Good morning, Dreyfus. I'm Eric Levine. And I'm Jack Marquis. Let's get right to the show. Printers print and exhibitions exhibit. Put the two together and you get Printoberfest, an exhibition featuring the work of all the current printmaking students. It's in the Building 2 Gallery. Make sure to see those works before it closes on November 10th. You can't appreciate all the arts in just Building 2 though. There's lots of performances coming up that you don't want to miss out on, so listen closely. Shakespeare in Love is showing Friday night from 7 to 9 p.m., Saturday from 2 to 5 and 7 to 9, and the final show will be Sunday from 2 to 5 p.m. There is only one thing that shines more than Eric's gleaming eyes, and that's our musicians, who are doing another performance. There's a band concert on November 14th in Meyer Hall. Make sure to check it out. Also, there's a fall dance concert in Meyer Hall on November 11th from 6 to 9 p.m. and on November 12th at 1 p.m. and 6 p.m. First off, Jack, my smile also shines more. You know what else is going to shine? Our upcoming season of girls basketball. Let's hear more from our package team. Coming back for their second year, girls basketball starts off a new season with new players on the team. The winter season has officially started for the girls basketball team. Practicing their skills to toughen up for the season, new and returning players have many goals for this year. Junior Sarah Bazil explains what her personal goals are for this year. I want someone to look up to me and be like, oh, I want to be like her on that team. I want to be a uh, representative of what the team should be like and everyone's so inclusive and I really enjoy that. With the coaching of Mr. Store, players run through various drills to get them prepared for games and in-practice scrimmages. With this being his second year of coaching, he as well has major goals for the team and season. Well this year we have a lot of young players so we are gonna essentially learn the skill of basketball first and then we're gonna learn some plays and then we're gonna learn to play together and hopefully at some point this year we'll start talking about winning games and getting fans here to watch us and have an exciting season. With the long season ahead of them, players hope to stay in shape and learn the skill of basketball while also having fun. I'm Sarah Ferguson from DSOA Today. The girls basketball team is really popping off. You know what else is popping off? That's right, popcorn. Don't forget about the school-wide popcorn fundraiser running from the 5th to the 8th, starting at 5 p.m. Saturday and ending 5 p.m. Tuesday. Be sure to butter up and go for gold to win some amazing prizes. You know what goes great with popcorn? Alphabet soup. Not the food, though. The show. The communication department's talented slam poets will be holding an open mic performance called Alphabet Soup in Miss Ray's room 1401 on Friday during lunch. Any HS members will get an hour for attending, but you must wear a communication art department shirt to attend. Cheer tryouts are today, November 3rd, after school in the gym. To try out, you must have your athletic packet completed on Activate. Text DSOA Cheer on Instagram with any questions. Asian Cultural Society is hosting an art gallery on November 18th and accepting submissions until tomorrow. They'll be holding an open mic night at the Starbucks and City Place on November 11th that people cannot sign up to perform in. More information is on the at DSOA ACS Instagram. Communication is the key to a healthy relationship, and in my very subjective, completely biased, and not to be trusted opinion, communications is the best and most talented art area, and therefore we are celebrating as we should. Communications Pride Week is happening, man, and it's time to celebrate. Communications arts majors, wear your club and major representative gear to school this week to show your pride. Well, even if you don't agree with Jack, which you should, at least we can agree that we can't wait for school on Tuesday, November 8th. Oh wait, there isn't any. Have fun. The DSOA College Fair is tomorrow from 4 to 6 p.m. and the Dreyfus PTSO is looking for donations to assist in the purchasing of goodie bags for college representatives attending the fair. Seniors, make sure to wear jerseys on the 11th because it's senior dress up day. Still figuring out what college is for you? On November 14th, the University of Alabama will be in the Media Center on November 17th. Savannah College of Art and Design will also be in the Media Center. We can't wait to see you there. Well, Dreyfus students, that's all we have for you today. I'm Jack Marquis signing off. And I'm Eric Levine. Have a great day.